Hey guys, what's going on? So we're coming at you with another video. In today's video, we got another Diamond Dynasty game. What I tried to do earlier was I tried to play a couple of Battle Royale games. I played them. I didn't record one. I recorded the other. I lost in both. So I just I'm giving it, giving up on Battle Royale. I'm not really having too much fun with it. But what I am having fun with is I'm having fun with. Diamond Dynasty and Road to the Show. So we got two videos coming at you today. This Diamond Dynasty that you're watching right now and Road to the Show later on today. So now that you know that, we got a couple additions to the team. You'll see it as we get into the game. You might only see one because one of them is a starting pitcher. But without further ado, let's get into it. Alright, so our opponent has a pretty cool logo and he's got an amazing team. He's got Xander Bogarts, he's got Chris Bryant, David Ortiz. You see there were uh, 10 and 7, but that's because of the Diamond Dynasty games. Or not the Diamond Dynasty, the Battle Royale games. We got Dexter Fowler leading now. And we got Carlos Martinez on, on the mound for us as we round out there to first. Debut for Carlos Martinez. That's not a new addition. No, we've had him in there for a while. Now we got Candyman Skeeter. The switch hitting Candyman Skeeter. Taking that cut fastball for a ball. 1 0 the count. Trying to be patient. And that one is a base hit for Candyman. This is a good fastball spot. Taking that for a ball. We got a walk. We got Ortiz. Runners on first and second. And that ball is hit into the gap. Two runs will score. Ortiz chugging into second base. We're up 2 nothing. Let's go, guys. So a slider close to the zone. Getting a strikeout. Let's go. Great start to the debut and this is the rookie Chris Bryant so I don't have to worry as much as I was worrying it's not the diamond and we're throwing that circle chain down and in throw this one down again he's swinging at it so let's throw that slider down and away to get the strikeout we get it we got back to back strikeouts two seamer low and away and he hits it high he hits it deep Skeeter back he can't make the catch there's a home run by David Ortiz here we go he's already got the bullpen going and that one is hit into the gap I was sitting on that high fastball and we got a double on the power swing by Chris Young and now we have Matt Duffy up. So now he throws something low. And there's a rifle down the line. Not quite hitting it where we wanted to. Mm, there's another low change up. Hitting it foul. Taking that high and in 12-6. And we're taking that for a ball. We're moving up. Yes, here comes the bullpen. Orange peel. Look at that guy. That's amazing. And we're taking that high fastball at 92. Taking that low slider. He walks us. We got our pitcher up. We got runners on first and third. That is a beautiful man there. And Martinez hits a deep one. And he doesn't make the catch. And Martinez is into second with a double. Three to one the score now with Dexter Fowler. And there's one up the middle. We got another run, and we got him safe at first. Nobody out for Candy Man Skeeter. His created player against my created player. Taking that for a ball. 2-0 the count. This is a fun situation. And we're hitting that 
foul the high four seamer. And we're hitting that one foul. Had her zone there, but just laid on it. And Skeeter hits it high and deep, and you can put it on the board. Yes! We are winning 7-1 to one in the second inning. As we hit a home run off this created player. And he throws inside to Ortiz, and Orange Peel is injured. Orange Peel is injured. Bruce Rondone now in. And he's asking for a concede. No, thank you. He has quit, so we're going to jump into another game. All right, so as you see there, he was a 14.37, now down to a 14.29. We're up to a 14.12, going from a 12.64. Let's see what our post-game reward is. You saw the Candyman Skeeter going yard, and we got the 70 overall Phil Coke. And we get Jackson Williams. So we're going to jump into another game, because I feel kind of bad that we got a quitter. But we just crushed that guy. Seven runs in two innings. Let's see what we can do now. Let's come jump into another game. So our opponent has another good team, like we always get. So we're the home team. We're 11 and 70. He's 343 and 423. Really, if we're talking about just regular old Diamond Dynasty games, we're a lot better. Battle Royale is killed us with three losses but we're gonna start him off with a fastball we got Martinez on the mound again so redemption time from the last one he's taking that one for a ball so we'll go circle change low Jacoby Ellsbury he's taking that one so he's got a 2-0 count Ellsbury is the 82 overall version a lot of speed, a lot of steel. Still the two seamer right there. Here's the pitch. Get a ground ball. Down no, he's taking it. No, three, three and zero, oh, and he's got Mookie Betts up next. Throwing that circle change, he swung three zero. Oh. All right. High fastball. Hopefully this one gets in the zone. It doesn't, and we walk him. All right. So now we got to deal with Mookie Betts. And he's hit well with Mookie. The Mookie of his team. And there's a double play. Let's go. Hit it on a line. We got a good situation there. Now he's got um, Curtis Granderson. That was a mistake slider, by the way. That was right down the middle. Hit a bullet. Just couldn't quite get it past me. So I was able to get that double play. And now we're in a good situation. This slider will be better. Hopefully. Hopefully I can get that location. Not getting him on that one. So let's throw another high fastball. When it's in the zone, he's not hitting it yet. He's behind. And he's taking that one. Two and two now. Throw that low circle change up right down the middle rather but we make the play we're out of the inning one two three after the walk and then the double play all right so as you see here my opponent has Jacob deGrom on the mound let's see what we do against him he's got good below he's throwing that slider inside at 89 miles an hour this is gonna be fun two seamer low no is a change up I was just looking for something low there like I always do might go high, maybe low still. Went low with the curveball. We get a base hit with Dexter Fowler. Raising that average from 160. And Skeeter goes high and deep and foul. Almost a home run for Skeeter again. And that one is hit down the line. He's going fastball now. No, he went slider, and we get Fowler to second. He's had a much better inning this inning. 
And it ends with a home run. Not good anymore for him. Let's go. We got Chris Young going deep. You can put it on the board. Yes. Up one nothing. Thank you to Grom. Here we go. All right. 0-1 count. Swing at that high fastball. 0-2 now. Mistake by me, of course. Swinging at that. Hitting it foul. I think that was a changeup. Looked like one. It was. 0-2 still with two outs in the second. And we just went back to back. Matt Duffy, you can put it on the board. Yes. Those back-to-back -back home runs were very important in this game. And we're swinging through a changeup. Out in front, one and two the count. Now we go contact swing. And we hit one high. We hit one deep. You can put it on the board. Yes, we got three home runs in this game. Thank you, Ortiz. We're one away from finishing up that David Ortiz mission. Plenty of pitches left in this at bat, hopefully, to do something well as we get a base hit with A-Rod. Taking it for a ball. There's a walk to Ortiz. Seven sounds a lot better than six, especially... I, I just got to do it. I love Martinez. I'm a Cardinals fan. I'm a Martinez fan. I have to do it. If he gives up a home run, though, you better believe I'm taking him out. Because and if there if a runner gets on, he's coming out of the game. Because I need to win this game. I need people with a lot of energy. So two balls and a strike now. High fastball. Hopefully this one gets where we want it to. It does. And we're going to throw this slider to get the strikeout of Chris Bryant. Instead, it's a base hit. All right. Thank you for your services, Carlos Martinez. Let's bring in the splitter thrower to face Alex Rodriguez. Should have been an error. Well, it was an error, but should have been an out. And bets. High and deep. Skeeter on the track. Makes the catch. Scary. Just scary. And we strike him out. We're one out away from getting a win here today. I could have done that in a song, but I didn't feel it. Mainly because that's weird. <laughs> I mean, I've done it before. But <laughs> I'm not going to do it here. All right. Important situation. Going for the combined shutout between Martinez and Brad Brock. Here we go. Splitter. Ground ball. Second base. We get the win. Shutout. Combined shutout, but we got the win. Carlos Martinez, player of the game. Six innings, four hits allowed, three walks, six strikeouts. So great game by Martinez. All right, let's see what our reward is. Let's see what our rating is. All right, guys, so here you go. He was a 1508. Now he's down to a 1498. We went from a 1412 to a 1563. We're on the rise in that ratings. Let's see what the reward is. Could get Boston. Could get Fenway. We don't get Fenway. We get Highland Park. All right. And we get Michael Blazik and Mac Williamson. And, hey, we get Minimaid Stadium. Daniel Webb. Wow, we got a lot of stuff there. All right, so I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I enjoyed making it. We got a 3 nothing win. We got a 7-1 to one win. Both of them, Martinez was pitching. So... I've had a lot of fun with that, and obviously, we uh, are now 12 and 7, I think. So we got a pretty good record going. Later on today, we got a uh, Road to the Show episode coming at you. But yeah, so I hope you guys like this video. Comment and subscribe, Foa Moa. Signing off. 
watch today's video. All right. Adios.